Greetings and welcome to this full guide on how you can save Cryptex SH SH blobs for future downgrading. You can use X8A4 to do so. And we are at its official GitHub page. It is completely free. It works on all devices, but full jailbreak is required to use it. You can see the supported versions right here and you will have to run it as root. Now, if you scroll down, you can see the usage with all the flags you can use. Now, it has to be installed on device, like I said, with a full jailbreak. So what you can do is you can go to the official GitHub page. As you can see it right here and now go to releases and you will have to get all these files to your device now as you can see i have this device it's an ipad 7 which is jailbroken rootless with Pelerin. so what you can do is go to safari and head to the same official github page for x8a4 and under releases you can go there and then get all these files one by one you can simply tap on them then hit download to get all these to your device. Now simply head to Cilio, then go to sources and make sure that the allocate.space repo is added because from there you will install allocate all categories and install allocate from here. Then search for preference loader and install it as well. Now go to the files app, browse downloads you will find all the dev files we just got. Now you can simply press and hold each of them, then hit the share button, then share it to Celio, then hit get queued and confirm to store the tools. You have to do so with all the apps using the same process. If you see a depends error with installing any of them like x8a4 make sure that you install the lib first and then the tool like for example for lib krw0 you will install the libraries first and then the tool once installed you can check by simply searching and see that all the required dependencies and tools are now installed for x8a4 and also for the lib krw now again go to sources and simply add this source called repo.charis.com if it is not added you can add a repo by simply hitting this plus button typing it here and then hitting add source from charis repo Go to all categories and install new term 3 beta tap on it then install it from here and you will see it on your home screen as new term now at the terminal type sudo space p a s s w d space root and it will ask you for the password for mobile you can simply use the password which you have set when you jailbroke your device so i will recommend using alphabet rather numbers so after entering the mobile password simply enter the same password then enter a new password then retype the new password once it is set now you can simply type su which means super user then enter the password you just set above and you will get a root now type sudo space x8 a4 space hyphen k space 0 x8 a4 then press enter and you will have to get this key you can see it right here under key all right so you can simply copy it in a safe place because we will be using it in the next steps now that you have got the cryptex key you will have to get your devices board config your ecid and the model identifier now to get the device information like board config and the model you can use ipsw.me simply select 
the device then select the platform then version you can see i have chose the ipad 7 the wi-fi version now i can see the device information from here and now i can see the model identifier and my board config right here now to get the ecid you can simply use itunes simply connect your device via usb then hit the model number a few times and you will find the ecid right here simply copy it now as you can see we have got the cryptex key using the x8a4 command we have got the board config we have got the ecid for our device and the model identifier and now we are good to go to proceed to the next steps now we will move to linux for the rest of the process you can use mac os as well all right so we are now on linux but before you use those tools and save the cryptex blobs we will have to install some dependencies so for your ease i have created this easy install you'll find it in the description or in the pinch command when you extract it you will find this install.sh and in the same directory simply right click and then open terminal here then type sudo space bash space install.sh press enter type in your linux password press enter and wait for the process to complete it will install all the required dependencies once the process is complete you can simply close out of it now as you know that we have already got the device details like board config ecid the model and also our cryptex key using the x 8a4 now we can proceed with aes nonce tool you can simply get to its official github page simply hit on code and then download a zip you'll find the zip file on your pc you can simply right click and then extract here and you will get this folder go to this folder then simply right click then open a new terminal here now here the command is python3 space aes underscore cryptex underscore nonce dot py or whatever is the file name and then space then simply copy the cryptex key leaving 0 and x this one all right you will simply copy it and then paste it in the terminal and you will see it right here then give a space then type 1 32 times you can simply count them they should be 32 all right and then you can press enter and you will get the entangled nonce all right we will have to work with this one so you can simply leave this terminal here do not close it because we will have to copy it in a while or with another tool so i will simply minimize it now you will have to use the tss checker you can simply get it from its official github page scroll down and under releases you will find the file for linux you can also find a file for mac os i am on linux so i will use this file i will get this file to my pc as you can see it right here now simply right click then extract here you do not have to make it executable because we have extracted it from an archive after you get this file in the same directory right click then open a new terminal now use the command sudo space dot slash tss checker space hyphen hyphen device so the device will be your device identifier for me it is ipad 7 comma 1 1 space hyphen hyphen board config so the board config is this one according to your device so mine is this one so i have put it here space hyphen hyphen ecid the ecid for your device then hyphen g after a space then space 0 x and 16 times 1 all right then space hyphen x space 0 x and 32 times 1 all right then give it a space then hyphen t and then you can simply copy 
the entangled nonce which you got using the AES tool or AES nonce tool then simply paste it here then give it a space then hyphen L space hyphen capital E space hyphen lowercase s space hyphen b if it is a device which is a wi-fi only version so my ipad 7 is wi-fi only so i am using hyphen b also in a while i will show you how you can get the basement serial number if you have a device with cellular capabilities like an iphone all right now you can simply press enter make sure that internet is connected simply type in the password for Linux press enter and wait for the process to finish you can see it is complete and we have saved the cryptex blobs and at the time of making this video iOS 18.2.1 is signed now in the same directory where TSS checker is present you will find the saved cryptex blob you can see I have opened it and you can see the generator and everything now, if you want to save the cryptex blobs for an iPhone, of course, it has the cellular capabilities. So you will have to type the baseband serial number also. So you will first of all connect your device via USB, then type I device space hyphen K space baseband serial number, then press enter and you will get this serial number you can simply copy it from here then you can use the same command just instead of hyphen b you will use hyphen c and simply type in or paste the baseband serial number here and then press enter the reason i got the baseband serial number because just for a demo for an example i have connected to my iphone 8 plus so that you can see how we can get the baseband serial number there is another method which allows you to totally skip the aes nonce tool and you can do so using only the tss checker now on your device when you use the terminal simply type sudo space x8a4 space hyphen x and you will get the cryptex seed you can simply note it down and then use sudo space x8a4 space hyphen t and you will get the cryptex nonce you can also simply note it down because we will need it in a while now as you can see i have noted down the cryptex seed and i have also noted down the cryptex nonce now you can use the tss checker of course simply right click and then open a new terminal you can see the command is exactly the same which we have discussed in method one but in the flag for hyphen x you will use the cryptex seed as you can see it right here all right and then in hyphen t you will simply use the cryptex nonce leaving 0 and x so you can only copy this and then paste it in the terminal and then use the rest of the flags using hyphen b or hyphen c according to your device press enter simply type in your passcode then press enter and you can see that we have save the cryptex sh sh blobs using this method also and you can see the saved cryptex blob is here in the same directory where the tss checker is present and open it and see the generator and everything that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself